Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome to this first look of Rescue HQ. This one looks like quite a fun one I think. Uh, tycoon based um, office builder I guess you want to call it, but the, uh, the offices themselves are municipal buildings for a city where we're going to be putting out firemen, we're going to be all oh, firefighters, excuse me, we're going to be putting out um, police and ambulance I think as well and maybe some others and some helicopters and all cool stuff. Uh, it's all about getting out there, doing emergencies and, uh, and earning money from the government for doing so. So we're going to jump in. This is in early access. Uh, this is a playtest weekend they're doing. Um, the full launch should be, or at least the, the, you know, the, the early access launch, should be around May. Uh, and the developers have very kindly given me three copies to give away. So if you look in the description, you'll see a link to a Gleam. Uh, all you have to do is pop your email address in there. There's a few other ways you can enter as well. I do need a valid email address because the three winners, their emails are going to be sent over to developers for them to send you the key out directly uh, when the game comes out next month. Okay, we're going to go for easy difficulty because I'll be honest with you, I haven't really got a clue what the hell's going on. Uh, I very played... I very played briefly i briefly very played no no <laughs> i played very briefly um just to again check uh, recording and all that sort of stuff so i've got a little idea what's going on but i know we have a mayor here who i think is a sociopath uh, seriously look at the stuff he says uh what's my name don't tell me your name first you can't well tough luck i dub the cadet so we're going to be cadet and we're going to be setting up firefighting, police, and medical departments. Uh, you better follow my word. I will. First, we're going to get a fire department set up and running. And uh, always, uh, anyways, you got some money. We have we've got a hundred grand set in there. Put juice, build a fire engine, gas bottles, and a hiring desk. Um, and we'll have some fire managers soon enough. He, I think he's an arsonist. I, I genuinely think he's an arsonist. Okay, so we're going to come down here into the build mode, and inside the garage or the garage, we're going to build an. LF10 fire engine. I messed up here first of all when I first played. I put down a DLK one and it just wouldn't happen. I was like, whoa. But no, it's only a small one we need. So we're going to swing that around here. Uh, that goes in there. Everything takes a little while to build, but we're in pause at the moment. So let's get, uh, let's unpause ourselves. There we go. They'll start running around. And you'll see this will start to unpack. At the moment, it's just boxes uh, getting ready to unpack. Uh, we need a hiring station. That happens within the office. That's a desk, um, I think it's that one there, hiring station, there we go. So we'll get one of them down there for staff to come in and, uh, you know, get a job. That's good. Uh, we need an air tank refill station. That's going to be in utility, I think. Air tank refill station, there we go. So we'll put one of them there. And air tank storage, we'll get a couple of those in. How's that? And then once they're built... If they're free, they'll come in and they'll fill the air tanks up and they'll store them over here. Okay, so that's actually everything. We're just waiting for the fire truck now. Here it comes. Boom. There we go. Look at that. Fire department. Now I can start to uh, forward fires. Obviously, keep growing your department. You'll even be able to handle kitties in trees. Good stuff. Okay. Definitely need more manpower if we're to thrive, though. We need to recruit more firefighters. New hires are usually rookies. They are nearly useless in the field unless they have a really strong superstition, uh, supervision. Uh, newly hired rookies are basically useless in emergencies because their muscle mass is equal to yogurt. Oh, same as mine. Uh, they can get stronger in a basic training area. Build, and that should be your next goal. Okay, so this time we've actually got to build the room. So we can click, we think we click here and it lets us drag the room. There we go. So we'll stick a basic training in there. That's good. Uh, we'll get a door. Nicely, the door snaps to the walls, but they don't. We're assigned an emergency. Okay, so first of all, then let's see if we can send them out. So we click up here. Okay, this is loads of info about what we need. So we need a compressed air tank. So we'll put that vehicle on. That gives us the water tank because the water tank's on the vehicle. We need one compressed air tank. There we go. And we need four people. Oh, you class as two because you're super good. Industrial experience in dealing with industrial area fires, plus one firefighting skill on industrial type emergencies. Uh, advanced firefighting, plus two. Uh, there we go. So two, three, four. 100% dispatch. Go then. Go for it. Oh, here they go. Look at that. Do so they all come and get ready? Yeah, they're all getting geared up. Okay, as soon as they're all in, we're going to screenshot them. Hello. Oh, God. <laughs> I was going to say, we'll screenshot that, but maybe not. <laughs> Woof, they're quick. Okay, well, while they're gone, 
Let's build a uh, a training. We have to unlock that. Okay. Don't really know why that happened or why it didn't happen. Um, let's do two of those, I guess, along there to start off with. So you're our last one in. Did we do it? Successful emergency. Every time you successfully complete the emergency, you gain reputation. Unlock new stations of vehicles, convert into money at the end of the week, ask for help on missions you can't complete. Your reputation stockpile is capped per week. First week, you can only hold 600. If you hit the reputation cap during the week, the cap will increase in the following week. Whatever reputation you gain beyond the cap is lost. Oh, okay, so it's almost not worth doing then if we got 600, but we got 50 for that. Okay. But otherwise, they've gone and got some training in. Okay, good. I've got three applicants. You cannot hire your applicants. You have hired the maximum number of crew for these departments. To increase this hiring cap, build more lockers. Firefighters need fire department lockers. Police need police lockers. Medical crew need medical department lockers. Check at the top of your screen to view your hiring capabilities. Ah, we have eight. So what do these do? Two? So they do two each. So let's... Um, what sort of room is this? Utility. So can we increase the space of utility? I know that this guy is telling me to do stuff, but right now, I want some lockers. There we go. Ten, twelve. Yeah, they pretty much double. So maybe it's like a morning and a night or something like that. I don't know. Uh, now we need a... What do we need here? A toilet and a kitchen and a bedroom. Okay, so... Let's do bathroom first. Oh, we've got a new emergency. Should we take a look at that? Might as well, might we? Something we can manage. Uh, LF10. Oh, it needs four compressed air. We haven't got enough. We can send all the crew out and maybe do it. Yeah, go on. Let's risk it for a biscuit because they're going to be waiting. Fresh souls, I mean, finding applicants. Uh, you can hire as many crew as the lockers you build support. Good. Let's keep expanding the common area by us, I mean you. Set up a bathroom and a small kitchen where people can eat in peace. No, they don't eat in the bathroom. Disgusting. I eat in the bathroom. Uh, don't have anything to eat. So they'll just go out, right, when you need them. I know, labour laws. Ah, okay. So, yeah, they run off if they're not needed. So, uh, this was the bathroom we were building. Okay, so, I'm guessing... Uh, we need well, we need a door in there, don't we? So let's put a door there. I'm assuming we can do this without having to have corridors. We can just build rooms off rooms. Okay, so toilets. I'm guessing like a whole row of toilets would be useful. And then what are the other options? Sinks. There's a whole row of sinks and oh, showers of course, because they're going to want to uh, shower. I'll tell you what. Let's do. Oh, it requires a wall. All right. I was going to say we do two rows of them here, but maybe we just do four for now. Okay, can we? Ah, how about something like that? All right, it's a bit, it's funky, but I think that works pretty well. That's good. Have a shower block, toilets and sinks. All right, so that's uh, what are you? Your the you're the bathroom. So let's then do a kitchen, right? And if it lets us, let's do the kitchen down there like that. Okay, and I will stick a door. Yeah, there, and we'll also stick one there, and then we can do corridor, right? So let's just bring the corridor up here. Okay. So the kitchen, I don't think there's much that goes in it right now. Let's have a look. We've got a uh, refrigerator, chairs. Um, it's only asking for a refrigerator right now, so we'll just put one of them down. I don't want to mess it up by not putting the right things down. And then a bedroom. We can have a big old bedroom here. Oh, it's a funny carpet. And in the bedroom we need beds. Okay, and it just needs one, but really we need one for each person on shift. It looks like we have a shift because we've only got five people in. It's telling us that we have 11. So I'm guessing there's like a morning and a night shift. So if we put down... What's that saying? Oh, objects can't be reached. Oh, that's fine. We've got to just... Uh... 
well, let's put six down like that. And then uh, a door. Okay. Oh, there's somebody filling up some gas. There we go. We could have took more gas if we'd have just hold it on a little second. Where are you going now? You're going to go and train? Oh, I didn't mean to do that at all. Oh. Oh, we could... Oh, we could do that look. Okay, well, we'll know for next time, hey? That would have done for the showers, actually. Um, training. Let's do that. There we go. All right, let's come out of there now. Okay. Successful emergency. We've got another 48 rep. Uh, build more beds. Well, there, there are like six beds. There should be no problem with people resting. I want to see who we've got. In, who, who we got in. They've gone out, look. I guess the beds just weren't there. I get, are they back now? Needs to train, needs to train. We'll get training then. Okay. Uh, night shift. Yeah, there we go. So these are going out. Okay, so we and we've got four coming in. Proceeds to next shift. Okay. Now I feel like we need to employ somebody. Um, rookie. They're rookies. We want to hire them for the night shift. Okay. So we've got six, and hopefully the rookie will go and train. Is that you? Is that who we've just applied, uh, employed? Jed Ramsden? Rookie. So let's see if we can... No, they're just coming and train. Okay, oh, we have a fire here. Okay, so we need... Oh, this is a little one. We need a ladder, though. Which we don't have. Cat got stuck in a really high tree. Two people are needed, one to climb after it and the other to catch it when it descends by itself, unlike the grateful feline, like the great feline it is. Uh, ah, okay, so I don't think we've got what we need for that. So let's come out um, and I guess we maybe extend the garage and build it. So there's a ladder on it. Let's have a look. Garage. A ladder. A water tank. And a large water tank. Yeah, we need one of those. Okay, so let's just pause the game and set them. And we'll build that. We could just do that, right? Surely? Okay, and then build one of you. In there. Now, I don't think that will be done in time. No, it's already gone, look. But next time there, we know that we need a ladder in that one. Okay. Toggle to send matching crew to repair the vehicle. Go on, then. Okay, we've got some tanks coming in. What do we need here? Oh, we need rep. Okay, so that's going to be just from fires then. Let's come out of the build mode for a moment. Don't really know what they're doing. Unless they just, we have to have one for this. I guess we just have to have one for this. These aren't really being used. Firefighter crews train here. Oh, here's a new one. Okay, you need water. Okay, and you also need compressed air. Good. So, you, you, okay, 100% dispatch, because that, oh, that second one there is not there anyway. So, I'm assuming the idea is, is eventually to have full two full crews on the night time, because, you know, the chances are we're going to get a couple of these coming in. Gone. They go out of there quick, man. What's this? There's a warning thing on it. I want to know what the warning is. Nobody. Oh, that's fine. I don't... Yeah, that's okay. They go there when they can, don't they? Alright, good. So this will hopefully give us like another 50 rep. So we need one more fire. Yeah, look at that. Successful emergency. Can we repair that? Do we have anyone who does repairs? Oh, man, we've got our second fire engine here that pokes through the ground a little bit. Okay, good. What are you doing? You have the traits of chemical specialist. Nice. There we go. Your tr rookie's getting trained now. So this class is as one here, I guess. Yeah, there you go. So now you're three of ten. Good. 
You're going for a poo? Okay. Don Carlito, the Mafia boss, has decided to testify against his peers in a few days. We need to make sure nothing bad happens to him at the time when he is most exposed. The Mafia boss on trial in the city. Judge asked for armed escort. Be ready with a police van, eight cops, and some assault weapons. My god. That all sounds pretty uh, intense. Well, we haven't got the ability to do police fans yet. Show all objects. Oh, look, there's loads. Now, just show us what's unlocked because we need to try and figure out how to do. Well, I'm assuming it pops up in the future. Here we get uh, resources. What's that? Oh, right, okay. Compressed air tank. We can have up to 13. 6, 12, and there must be one one on there or something. Sniper gear. Wow, there's all sorts, look. Oh, okay. So at the moment, there's food, there's food, there's a fridge. You can go get some food if you want. Okay, looks like there might be a bit of a queue for the fridge. Maybe uh, a second fridge wouldn't do us any harm. The second fridge probably do us good. All right, I'm going to speed the game up a little bit because we're pretty much waiting for. Uh... Here we go. The shift is changing. Okay, enthusiastic. Okay, firefighter. Yeah, good. Okay. So next shift, rookie trainers are coming in. Here we go. So, good, another easy one. So, four of those. Um, water tank and... Uh, you don't count, but I wonder if sending you will give you points. It needs to train to become useful. I'm going to send you out just... I want to see Tanika. Remember Tanika. I want to see Tanika get some... Uh, some trusty training from... From going out. Okay. Off your pop chops. Right, let's have a look. Oh, we got loads of XP for that one. Never get to increase these spaces as your crew grows. Okay, time to build the police department. There we go, we've got time to do that. So, uh, the City Hall Fools really allow private pr police to take prisoners. Now, you better build police. Oh my god. Time to build the police departments. These... Those city hall fools really allow private police to take prisoners. Now you better build prison cells. Remember that prison doors must connect to an office. Let's set up a basic police precinct then, so our people can go out and fight crime. Okay. All right. So that that's office. Okay. Let's just hold on a minute. We need four police lockers, so these can go. Do we do we keep the do we keep it all separate? We haven't got that much space, have we? So I'm, I'm guessing we don't keep it separate. So, uh, utility. Police lockers. So what we can do is have these here. One, two, three, four. Police cruisers in the garage. But the garage is pretty much full. We're going to have to have a second garage here. I'll tell you what, let's, um, let's build a corridor to it. To there. Oops. Right. Police crews are unlocked. We need to have one of those. Looks like we can squeeze two of them in, so I'm going to do that. Double doors. I think double doors are good there. It requires a street. Oh, that's a main entrance door. Sorry. Okay, so that's the police garage. Um, so we'll extend the office a little bit, I think. So like there. Okay. Stick a door. Stick two doors in? Does that look silly? Yeah, but I'm, I'm okay with it. Um, police desk. 
So we get a police desk in there. Why is that space blocked? Uh, they've got to be able to go to there, I see, sorry. Okay, police desk. Paperwork storage. It's just a little filing cabinet. Could go next to the desk there. And a police hiring station. Wow, this, this place gets big quick. Okay, there it can fit. And we need some more rep, so we're waiting on more... F oh, hello. Every police raises emergency generates paperwork. Paperwork must be processed in many stages. At each processing step, you gain money and sometimes reputation. So emergency paperwork, police desk files, detective desk, cases. Cases and evidence are finally processed to the investigation board to produce your investigation reward. Okay. Well, I don't think we have anything else to set up yet. Paperwork storage. No, we'll do it as it asks, because it hasn't asked us to do it yet. We've got another fire coming in, that's fine. So we need some water. Uh, no, 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 not that. Oh. That one for water. Four of those. And. Ah, oh, we didn't check. Ah, yeah, look, she's a firefighter now. So I'm going to send Adam this time. Sit around and do nothing. Might as well get trained, huh? So, who are you? Because you look like you're struggling a little there. Is it? Are, are we struggling? Move. That better. Hmm. You don't seem too happy there, do you? Metal crew working at the station. Okay, so you're on it. You just not sat there, and all right. Uh, water. I need to get somebody on the on those. Oh yeah, look, that is definitely the way to get them trained, isn't it? Firefighter. Boom. Okay. Yeah, we could do with another one of these. Oh, actually, we could do with somebody working on them. Um, nobody's working here. I know. Gotta hurry up because we're gonna run out of tanks. Maybe we take somebody on to do it. Firefighter, hire for the day shift. Firefighter, hire for the day shift. Okay, let's try that. I don't really know whether HQ's weekly cost is up to the end of the week. Cost of this may be smaller. Planning payment will eventually. Okay, but we're getting yeah, we're earning money. So as long as we've got enough money there to cover that money, I think. Emergency. Oh, we missed one. Enforcement is up and running. Now it's time to finish some business. Alas, I talk too much. Prepare armed police for a mafia boss trial. Okay. You're not going to give me any more heads up than that. Oh, wow. Okay. We need to keep these going out because we need the money. So, we don't have enough. Does that help at all? No. Alright, go for it. Okay. So, what do we need for armed police then? Coming in. Oh, we've got hardly anyone coming in, look. Maybe we don't need police at night? No, surely you need police at night. Applicants. Let's take some police. Higher for the night shift. Higher for the night shift. Higher. Okay. I'll do for now. A couple and a rookie. Uh, okay, so armed police. Let's have a look. We now have a new option in the bathroom. A vanity mirror. 
We now have an option in the bedroom. Bunk beds. Oh, I like the, like the idea of bunk beds. Okay, let's just pause the game a minute while we sort this out. Sell object. Bunk beds. That cost us 200 to, to do, but I think it was worth it. Because we could pretty much double. Okay. I hope they don't take too long. There we go. In the office, we can now do a file storage. An extended cabinet for storing files. Files can be processed at detective desks. So we'll put one down. Okay. Training. Bench press and training door. Is that a door they can kick in? That's pretty neat if it is. Put a door they can kick in there. And that one's for both, okay. That's big, isn't it? We'll have to build another room somewhere. Okay, we've got a fire. Let's send them out. One of those, that's good. Oh, that's just a nice little fire. I'm going to send Jed as well, getting trained up. Okay, so. Prison. Cell bench. A bench required when prisoners await their processing within a cell. Can't feel any looks. Secure jail area door. Master ball. Crazy to be inaccessible to inmates. Scientists argue that inmates are incapable of even perceiving them. Can only be built facing an office room. So. So. Let's build and let's extend our office down here, right? And then let's have the uh, prison like that. Okay. Then we can unlock the door to go there, not inside prison. Okay, over there. Right. Oh, we've got a police emergency. It's the first one of those. So we just need a cruiser. And two police. Do we not need that then? Oh no, they still have to have a car. Okay. Yeah, go for it. Alright. So, prison cell needs some... Some benches. I mean, again, this is one of those like holding cells, you know, where it's they take people. It's not like they're not, they're not staying here permanently, are they? It's not like a jail. I don't think. I'm tempted to get a sofa. That costs two hundred. Does it use them up or? Oof, yeah, it does. Okay, well, that wasn't a good idea. But we could put one of these in the kitchen. Oh no, it needs to be in a rec room, okay. Another rec room there on the back of the kitchen. Ah, it's got a little telly and everything. Nice. They can come and chill out there, that's good. Successful emergency. So we're still needing stuff here, right? Uh, be ready with a police van, eight cops and some assault weapons. We're not even close to any of that yet. I don't know how we get that involved. The whole quests have gone away. But do you know what? I'm I'm quite enjoying this one. This is this is fun. Night shift they're mostly keeping, they're lazy. It's the new thing in the bathroom is a vanity mirror. I'm really not fussed about that. The only thing we can do... Ah, here we go. A police van. So... Utility? Hazmat? Oh, I was really hoping that somewhere there would be big old guns. What's outside? Oh, just a door. Nice. Prison, we've got relaxation, training... 
office. They don't keep guns in the office, do they? Hello. She's the next shift, okay. Medical, nothing yet. Kitchen. Garage. It's the weapons I'm interested in. Because we can get police up, we can get police officers. And we can get should we put the truck in? Fire vehicle, police van. Is it is it just say a van, does it? Police van. Oh we need 250 no, okay, we need to get we need to get some of these on the go. Come on. Right, water. Or compressed air. They're getting there. They're getting done a little quicker there, that's good. Dispatch. Okay. They're gonna go out and earn us some good stuff. Since we built that one, there's not been a single one pop up the needle of the ladder. <laughs> kind of infuriating, to be honest. I like how the doors are left open so you can just dive in. One thing I will say is this outside, unless we have to buy the outside, maybe we have to buy the outside. Let's see if we can do that. No. No, we are quite limited to our space to start off with. Thank you. How much was the police van again? There. 250. Oh, we're gonna need a couple more. A couple more uh, thingies. Here we go. There's a big fire. Uh, oh, it's not a big fire at all. But it needs one of those, and you've got to do it on your own, mate. I wonder if there's any like. I suppose they get worn out if we use them a lot, because that guy has gone out on every single one now. Ramon. He's like superb. Look, here he is. Enthusiastic. Ah, okay, so they do have experience. What you wage? I'm getting my money's worth out of him. Doesn't seem they have like traits, you know, tiredness, needing a wee wee, that sort of thing. So that's okay. Oh, he's going the big one this time. Oh yeah, it was a ladder, wasn't it? That's right. So when that's at zero, they win. Just gonna have a sip of water. Oh, that's good water. Okay. And uh, back. Nice. Only 20 for that. I suppose it was quite a small one. It literally does seem that we are just waiting for stuff now. I'll tell you what, I'll do a couple of little missions and I'll pop back once we've got what we need. Okay, uh, move stuff around a little bit. Move the training room up to the top here so we can get some stuff in. We've got some dumbbells now that they can both use, police and firemen. And then use that extra space there to squeeze the office around a little bit, make the place a bit bigger. Right. In the meantime, we've still got plenty of stuff to do. Uh, unfortunately, you are out on emergency, so hopefully you come back in time. Uh, but if not, we can afford, if we can fit in, we can afford the car. Let's have a look. Got a horrible feeling it ain't going to fit. There we go. Yeah, look, it's a four wide one, unfortunately. Um, so what we can do then is we can clear that. Right, and then we can put you in as garage space you in as a door no, no then we can move you over one and then we can get you in there okay that should work so the only thing I'm struggling to find there to finish off with is Guns, bomb disposal, armory, stores, assault gear. That's what we need, right? Okay, what do we need to unlock it? Police operated resource facility. Complete expand common area. Okay, what's what's expand common area? Hmm. Is it that? Is that what he wants me to do? Put in a vanity mirror? Can they go over the sink? No. 
No, there's absolutely nowhere for one of these to go in this small space that we have that we call the bathroom. Uh, all right, uh, let's. I suppose we could extend the bathroom a bit. Put another row of toilets in, another row of showers in. Oh, it does it automatically, that's good. Okay. All right, now we've put everything in there, but yeah, definitely doesn't seem. Could be a bug, like I say, it is an early access play, play test. I mean, to be honest with you, it could be that could tell they gate it. I just don't know. I just don't know, unfortunately. And if I'm missing something, I'm super sorry. But yeah, you would think there would be an extra quest in somewhere. That's just emergencies. Let's have a little look around. Overall performance is 62. Shift is changing. Oh, 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 oh. hello. This one that's both? Tutorial department tab title. <laughs> Emergency involves multiple departments. Multiple different departments require different vehicles. To change which department you see, click on the tabs on the left of the window. Okay. Oh, right. Cool. So, this requires... Um, Fire firemen. Car has crashed into a building when taken according to fast. There are no victims, but the driver seems to have been drunk. Right, okay. So we have those, and we have a cruiser, and two of you. This is going to give us 70 reward. That's 40. That's 60. See, that's 60 on its own. You need water. You don't necessarily need water. So I'll tell you what, then. We can send both of these out. You do you. All right. And then you do you. Firefighter requires one more crew slots. Ah, it only seats four people. That seats six. There we go then. Okay, so we can't do both. Never mind. We could do maybe that one. Send the van out. That has tactical gear on it. That we're not using. That's going to pretty much empty the place. <laughs> Look at them all go. Look at them all go. I'm going to try and pause as it leaves. Oh, it's so hard to do. <laughs> yeah, and they're all up as well. And they're speedy, they're speedy. Okay, good. All right, well, yeah, I, I, unless I'm missing something. We missed one there, I know. We couldn't do them all, unfortunately. Unless I'm missing something... I can't figure out a way of completing this one by having some assault weapons. And assault weapons seem to be in the utility section once they're unlocked. Armory, stores assault gear. We need 500. It might just be that we have to get that number up to 500. Okay, they both did well. Good. Wow. Um, vehicle breakdown. Okay. Which one? That one. We can repair though, right? Police. Um, go on then, out in the cruiser, off you pop. And this one, go on out in the van, why not, off you pop as well. Send you both out. And I'm hoping somebody can come and fix this. Are they doing it? Particularly look like it's going off. Oh no, it is, yeah. This takes a good chunk of time. We are pretty, yeah, we're working on that one. Thank you. Cool. I've enjoyed this. I I, um, I, I think I'm going to leave it for now because with the with the with the uh, release coming out next month, that'll be a perfect thing to play next month because we've got quite a bit on there at the minute with Anno and Tropico and stuff. But I'm really glad I jumped into it and I really appreciate the devs um, getting in touch with me. And like I say, you can win a copy. So check out the Gleam description. The, the in the description there's a Gleam link. Um, and make sure you put an email address that you use because um, the key will be sent to your email uh, when the game comes out in uh, next month from the developers. It won't be from me. So uh, so yeah. Awesome. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you can give us a like. It really helps out the channel. If you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Any thoughts, queries, suggestions, you can pop them down in the comments. Fancy a chat, you can find me on Twitter. I'm at John T. Sparrow. So let's join in with the Geekism community. You can do so over on our Geekism Discord server. You'll find the link for that in the description. Thank you to all of our patrons. They make these videos possible through their incredible support at patreon.com slash geekism. Oh, we don't have them yet. But we have those. Needs repair. Oof. 
Um, thank you very much for don't forget to check out your affiliate links get yourself some cheap games and other goodies while supporting the channel at the same time thanks so much for watching I'll see you in the next one